Kanaka Comics is a Kanaka Wahine owned company that strives to share the legends of Hawaii in a unique way as wearable art. And we're grateful to have this amazing Wahine with us today, Brooke Hutchins of Kanaka Hi. Comics. <laughs> Hi, Hi, Maitita. Hi. Hey, hey, you know, now the last time you were here, um, we got a chance to see designs featuring Punia and the yeah. ghosts of Keokaha. That was kind of like a nod to your hometown. Yeah, well, yeah, well, I'm from Kona, but uh, it is a nod to um, Hawaii, Hawaii Island. Island. Yes. yes, beautiful. And then we also saw, then we kind of went jump islands a little bit, maybe. Yeah. And we saw uh, Maui Akamalo, yes. right? The stories of Maui, our mischievous kupua, demigod. So what do you guys have for us today? So for today, <laughs> we're going to talk about Hi'iaka. Hi oh. Hi'iaka. You know, okay, wait, sister, her legends are... We have just so much stories I about know. her. So I definitely want to be able to talk about what stories we're going to feature specifically for this. But before we get to that, I just wanted to ask, how come active wear? I mean, so I'm, I'm on KanakaComics.com and, and, I'm, and I'm seeing, you know, these beautiful leggings and the biker short style and sports tops and, and you know, even like, you know, that kind of fanny pack, body, body bags and stuff like that. But, um... How come only active wear? Well, because superheroes always wear active wear. They're always wearing like, you know, when you see the superheroes, they're wearing like leggings, they're wearing like body types. Oh, stuff. they're wearing tights. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> of course you wear Oh, them. so then our next one gonna be on Kate coming out. <laughs> yes, or like a full body like active wear. I love that. I love that. Okay, but for now we're starting with the legs. Yes, yes. And we're legs. gonna and, and we're dropping the Hiyaka leggings. Tell me a little bit about the stories we're gonna be seeing here. Oh, okay. Yes, so the Hiyaka, like I love Hiyaka, but um, you know, the Hiyaka is so, it's like so many versions and it's such a big epic. So we decided to just start with um, the part where Hiyaka um, revives Lohiau, which was Pele's lover, right? So she travels all the way from Hawaii Island to Kauai to retrieve Pele's lover. So, um, but we decided to just focus on the revival because I feel like Hiyaka is all about like, revival, um, rejuvenation, and regrowth, especially like in her elemental form, because she's like, after like Pele destroys something or like, you know, wipes away stuff, Hi'iaka comes and she to like- heal. To heal, to heal regenerate, yeah. Yes, 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 yes. So I thought that was perfect, because it's like she's like reviving someone, bringing someone back from the dead, mm -hmm. you know? So I thought this would be perfect to show like who she is. I love this. And for those of you that are maybe, might not be too familiar with the Hi'iaka legends, um, Hi'iaka is one of the sisters of Pele. And, um, and, and yeah, she's gone through the entire islands yes. and she has made um, her, her mark on each of the islands, but I just love this particular story of her reviving Lohiau. Yeah, mm. and you know, her her epic is so cool because it's like, it's about this young woman, right? She starts off, I mean, she's so young, and then she's tasked with this huge responsibility, and then she goes all the way, and then she goes through all these challenges, she goes through all these obstacles, she goes through like near-death experiences, and then like she, she like comes out, and she's like this like, you know, powerful independent goddess that we see as Hi'iaka. So almost like a great uh, a great person to emulate, a great yeah. example of the kind of wahine and yeah. even kane that we can be when we go through challenges and trials yeah. too, yeah? Because she, she made it. Yeah. She made it. She made it. Okay, sister, but we want to make it to Hilo to get this beautiful design because <laughs> yes. I heard that you're only going to drop this in Hilo, right? Yes, oh. only in Hilo, yeah, for Mary <laughs> Okay, okay, so where are you guys going to be for Mary Monarch? Where are you going to be stationed? So we're going to be at Nanimau. Nanimau? Yeah, Nanimau okay. Gardens. And then and if my viewers don't get a chance to come to Hilo to see you, will they still be able to get this? Yeah, so after Nani, um, after Mary Monarch, um, whatever is left, we will put online next week. Beautiful, week. I love that. You've got all the information right there on your screen. Grab that epic of Hi'iaka in your active wear, just like one superhero <laughs> with Kanaka Comics. Thank you for joining oh, us, Brooke. You. We love you, sister. Hey, you know, we're gonna be right back with birthdays after the break, right here on Island Life Live. Okay, get my size. Gotta get my size, yeah. <laughs>